like literally I, I saw the tripod leg I'm like that's a tripod leg what's the do oh there's a camera oh hi hello everyone my name is Judah and welcome today to another daily vlog now we're starting the day off pretty odd if I'm honest now last night my sleep was ruined by this one thought that went through my mind and I couldn't get rid of it because it's so relevant it's so scary that I just couldn't get past it and honestly it's it's something that's really, really awful and seriously scary. I'm not going to go into detail because it's super duper negative and I don't want to put that thought in other people's head because it's awful. I, I just really don't like it and I don't want to think about it anymore and I don't want to have to edit me saying about it. So we'll just forget about it, head off to work, which is what's happening today. I've got a short little shift of four and a half hours. Shouldn't be too bad today because of course I don't really know. I'm just hoping more than anything, let's be completely and utterly honest. But anywho, I'm going to head off about now, get going, hopefully arrive to work on time, check why the heck my phone's going off while I'm recording. This is freaking terrible. I think that's a text. I don't normally get texts because no one loves me. No one at all. Sweet, so I've just arrived to work after what was a very odd, bizarre ride for many, many reasons. One, the weather was terrible, which made it absolutely awful and super duper hard. Well, it wasn't awful, it was just a lot of hard work. You know, a headwind, there was a little bit of rain, it was really cold, it was just not nice. It wasn't until I got to the motorway where things got slightly weird. So I headed up onto where I get onto the motorway because I cycle along the motorway. And the first thing I see is one of the flashing signs with the arrows telling you to go a different way than normal. I'm like, what? That, that's weird, there's no works going on here. So I keep riding towards it and it's not until I get right close that I notice several things. First off, there's a truck parked in the middle of nowhere, or not in the middle of nowhere, in the middle of the road blocking off an entire section, and right next to the truck, there's an overturned digger. You can just see this digger going, well, you can't actually see the digger going, you just can tell it's gone. I'm just having fun saying that, that, that sound effect. But pretty much, that digger had overturned off a truck, and that's kind of scary. I mean, if someone had been standing there, that would have been a dead person. It's freaking terrifying. And on top of that, the lights were out, you know, you had the flickering lights, there were the police there, there was even a film crew there, or one guy with this camera and I'm like, ooh, that's more interesting than the, the crash thing that's just happened here. Like, literally, I, I saw the tripod leg. I'm like, that's a tripod leg. What's the do? Oh, there's a camera. Oh, hi. But I made it past that. No problems whatsoever. Ah, it was just a little bit odd, a little bit interesting. It wasn't until I got to work that something really exciting happened. Okay. So it's not that exciting. It's only exciting because I'm a bit of a dork and numbers and things like that really matter to me. So yesterday I worked as per normal and it felt super duper busy. There was a ton of stuff and it was just really, really hard. And for me, one of the most rewarding parts of my job, and this sounds kind of dumb, is seeing the amount of money that Hangdog has reaped in after a day. Because I have to find out that is. And pretty much yesterday, I think that's the largest amount I've ever seen Hangdog make in a day, and that's just for me. And honestly, that makes me feel super duper good. I know it's a little bit bizarre and a little bit stupid, but frankly, I'm just being honest. It looks so cool to be able to look through the details and find out, hey, I helped with that. And frankly, none of the money is going to me other than what I am owed. All of that is going to my boss, but it's more just really nice to see that the work that I put in is able to get that for him, if that makes sense. It's able to get better things around this place. You know, every little step that I do helps Hangdog, helps me, it helps everyone in the long run. Anywho, it's time for me to put down the camera, get on with the shift, get this job done, because that's the only reason why I'm of course here. Hopefully today will be an alright shift. I haven't had been having the best shifts lately. But it's a Monday morning, so I'm hoping it shouldn't be too busy. And frankly, I've got some work to do on the computer. There's a couple of emails there. I've got some time to put in. I've just got some stuff to do that I don't really want to have to bother with customers. And I know that sounds terrible, but frankly, I'm just being honest. And if you're a customer at Hangdog, I don't hate you. It's just that, you know, it's easier without you. That sounds really bad. Please don't hate me. as so I've just finished off the shift and I'm about to head home on my bike 
I had some rock climbing fun, I, I had a quick boulder. Completed one of my projects was fantastic. Right now though, I'm gonna ride home with my dad, hopefully have an enjoyable time, especially considering it's a tailwind this time rather than the headwind that I got on the way to work. So, without further ado, I'm just gonna head off because I'm holding him up and I just wanna get home to be quite frank with you because I got some YouTube to watch, some video games to play and, and some stuff to do. I don't know what that stuff is, probably think.